breaking the wall of vaccine inequality. Lamia al Fuhoid, Falling Walls Lab, Kaust. It is not fair that some people have access to life saving vaccinations while others do not. And we can think let's donate vaccines to those developing countries and this should solve the problem, shouldn't it? But do you know that more than 50% of the donated vaccines were discarded simply because they lost their functionality by the time they arrived? This is because some of the vaccines utilize the groundbreaking mRNA technology, but these require specific refrigeration at extremely cold temperatures. So you can imagine how difficult it would be to transport the vaccines under those conditions. Even in the developed world, the complicated storage has led to millions of doses being damaged. But I have a solution for that. We came up with the idea of utilizing solvents formed from natural materials like sugars and natural acids, which have a unique ability to form protective networks around the molecules, preventing their degradation. So I found a combination that can greatly enhance the stability of vaccines by protecting the mRNA. The solvent can be added to the vaccines, eliminating the need for refrigeration. It can be safely administered with the vaccine, making an already functional vaccine much more stable. And on top of this, it is environmentally friendly, formed from low cost materials, and is very easy to synthesize. Using the solvent, we were able to extend the shelf life of the mRNA from a maximum of half a day in the current COVID vaccines to a minimum of 21 days at room temperature. So with this solution, we can increase the accessibility of vaccines to billions of people around the world, including 1.2 billion people in Africa. And the best part about this solution, it is not limited to COVID-19. It is applicable to all mRNA vaccines for other infectious diseases and the ones being developed for malaria, AIDS, and cancer. With this solution, we can ensure equal opportunities for people to be healthy, regardless of their country's <coughs> economy. Thank you.